Hi there, Jim Schumacher with Smoky Lake Maple Products. I'm explaining a, a programming procedure on the Simplicity Auto Draw. And this will be a similar procedure on all three of our systems. This happens to be, the, like I said, the Simplicity. It's our most basic one. But it's plugged in and it's powered up. As you can see, the probe is just sitting on the workbench here. And that's why it's reading approximately room temperature here. So what I'm going to do is show how to change the displayed temperature with the program offset inside the machine. Um, reason for this is some people want their auto draw off to be drawing off at exactly 219 degrees, which is 7 degrees, above Fahrenheit, which is technically where syrup finishes. Another practical reason is some people are programming this with the use of a um, barometer so that they need to have it uh, drawing off at an exact temperature. It has to be very exact. Um, for most applications, it doesn't matter what the display says as long as it's drawing off at a, at a consistent temperature, making perfect syrup. But anyway, as you can see right now, it's displaying 65.7 degrees Fahrenheit. I can make this say anything I want by reprogramming. Um, and I'll show you how to do that. When you hold the set button, You see it go to alarm mode, which is normal. Here you can adjust your alarm. That's a, that's a very uh, common function that you'll use. And when you get it, the LCY will be set to zero. If you hit set over and over, you'll go from alarm to LCY zero. That's the only two options you'll have. But if you go to LCY and go up to number six, you will actually be able to access more screens. Now here's the one you're looking for, the SC mode. It's currently at uh, a half a negative half of a degree and I can move that down as I said before we were at 65.7 degrees Fahrenheit on the display let's just go down to negative 1.5 instead of negative 0.5 hold the set button in you'll go back to your home screen now it's a 64.7 before I changed that offset it was at 65.7 I moved it down one degree now it's reading one degree less let's make this say let's make this say 66.7 Hold your set button down, you're back to alarm. You're already in LCY6 because that's where I left it. Now you're in SC again. Now let's move the temperature up to negative, um, to a positive uh, half a degree. Hold the set button in. Now it's displaying 66.7. Nothing changed, our room temperature didn't change. I changed the offset. So now you can see how you can make that display say whatever you want. Um, not changing the accuracy, not changing the parameters, just changing the display. You're, you're changing the offset. Um, you could put the, the probe in boiling water and you could set it at exactly 212 degrees if you wanted to while the, while the probe was in boiling water. Um, a lot of different things you can do just to make it suit your, your needs exactly. I'm going to actually go back in and set this one back down to, to the negative 0.5 where it was because that's where it was programmed. Uh, and then I'm going to go back to the LCY and move it back down to zero so that can't easily be changed on accident. Hold the set button in. Now we're right back where we were, 65.7. And I'll show you, I'll warm up this probe with my hand um, to show you that it's, the, the temperature was just be, being very steady for us while we did this video. So hopefully that helps with anyone that uh, needs to do any offset changes on their, any of their Smoky Lake auto draw -off systems. And as always, feel free to call or email. There's a lot of information on the website and also on the, on the manual you received with the unit. Thank you very much.